Okay, good. Good evening and bon venu, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, welcome back to another tutorial video. I guess I'm a tutorial fucking channel now, so yeah. Anyway, today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to do the lovely, lovely voice of Soundwave. Which Soundwave specifically? I don't know. It depends on how you set this thing up. For me, it's uh, Generation 1 Soundwave specifically, the one with the cool, you know, vocoder effect. Okay, so first things first open up your um, audio engineering uh, application on my in my case I'm using audacity it's free you guys can get it as well and the next thing you need to do is get this thing called a uh, sound wave carrier or vocoder tone I'll have a link in the description for you to download it uh, so drag it drop it in and uh, then you have to uh, left click on this and make this into split stereo to mono uh, get rid of one of these and then add mono track and then click on this select this and then click on record and start doing the voice oh make sure this is mute as well so you don't like you can like not hear anything in the background while you're recording so now to do the voice generally speaking you need to have a lower registry that means you have to like have a very low pitch guttural voice uh, what people in the industry might call it is a dr claw voice and uh, it goes something like this um i i am soundwave chief communication officer of the decepticons yeah for those of you who are unable to pull off that type of voice, what I'd recommend you do is go to effects and play around with pitch and make your pitch lower and change your speed if you like. Play around with that and you'll be able to achieve that what you call deep, maybe even guttural voice if possible. And uh, yeah, anyway, so I'm going to start recording this. I'll just read some of my viewers' um, comments at the same time while I'm dubbing this because, you know, I, I'd be much more cooler if i were to like read some of my viewers like lines over here uh ah, yeah, here's here's a good one right here's a good one moral of the story do not under any circumstances fuck with sound waves cassettes and there we go all hail sound wave <laughs> Right, so that's nice. Lord Soundwave. Hmm. It has a nice ring to it. That's nice, that's nice. Let's see if we can get maybe two more or one wave. Soundwave wins. Fatality. Yeah, I guess we'll go holy shit, 10 out of 10. Holy shit. Out of ten. So yeah, that's 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 pretty much it. Commence operation. Like, comment, and subscribe, or else. <laughs> so yeah, that's all the audio. And uh, once you're satisfied with all of this, uh, you can go ahead and play them back and check. And once you're done with that, you can get rid of a portion of this split clip so like this cut so once you're done recording this as is uh, what you're gonna have to do is uh, before anything you have to switch the positions of this move this track above this one uh, and then what you have to do is press uh, control a and then make it so that this thing turns into make stereo uh, stereo track and then once you do that you click on effect distortion and modulation click on vocoder and preview to check whether it's you know the thing you want to sound like and also these slides are made the way i want them to so that they sound the way i want them to you can play around with them as much as you want but for now i'm satisfied with this so preview moral of the story do not and as you can see it sounds pretty decent uh, so far so I'm going to hit apply and then we have to wait for this to, you know, finish loading in. And bada bing bada boom, let's check what it sounds like. Moral of the story, do not 
Under any circumstances Fuck with sound waves cassettes All hail sound wave Lord sound wave It has a nice ring to it Sound wave wind Fatality Holy shit Ten out of ten Comments Operation Like, comment And subscribe And bada bing bada boom Hopefully once you're done you no, obviously know how to export the video. I don't have to go into detail. Make sure it's in .mp3 format and you know where you save the uh, recordings. And uh, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. Uh, if you guys want a more detailed rundown on how to do the voice and uh, how to like run the program, there's a tutorial which I uh, referenced linked in the description. So yeah, I hope you liked, comment, subscribe. And uh, see ya.